All right, first indoor experiment, running the air conditioner. Instead of being outside and venting outside, we are venting to a phase change material. It's a sodium sulfate mix. I'll, uh, I'll post a link to the video where I, I learned about this mix and formula, and unfortunately, I don't think I made enough. Uh, it does work for a little while. Um, unfortunately, I realized I need about two liters of material so this is really only a few cups. Uh, not sure if the 150 joules per gram, uh, which should end up cooling this room by about five degrees, worked, as the temperature did end up rising uh, on the hot water line well over 100 degrees. So, uh, but while it was cold, it did in fact blow cold air out, something like, I don't know, 70 degrees. I was expecting it to work out a lot better. So, I think I'm going to try this again, except instead of xanthan gum as a binder, I may try methyl cellulose uh, to give it a, a bit more viscosity, and then uh, I'm, I'm just going to have to make a whole lot more. I may have to add another radiator, though, because I'm not sure it's actually like transmitting enough heat, and I don't want to risk putting carbon in there, uh, which may damage the aluminum. The salts on their own are neutral, so the aluminum probably doesn't care. It'll make a passivation layer. It'll be all right, but... Eh, proof of concept, at least it kind of works. Worked for a while. Ran for about half an hour, 45 minutes before it kind of crapped out. I think I could do better. So the general idea here is that the, uh, the heat from the room uh, gets pulled from this radiator, pulled by the Peltier Junction into the hot water line, and then dumped into our phase change material. Uh, eventually the idea would be another radiator out or or even uh, switching back and forth between the two where at night we would then push the hot air out into uh, the outside. I have a feeling I'm probably going to need a big, big bucket though, you know, like five gallons, which is, you know, you're getting up towards like 12, 15 liters. Not sure if we need that much, but eh. I do have four pounds or five pounds of salt, so I'm gonna try making a bigger batch and seeing if I just need more, you know? Eh, so far so good. I think it's good proof of concept. Thanks a lot, like and subscribe.